Everybody, so on this Sunday stocks and option talk, you won't see me because I'm kind of still ill. Today, we'll be talking about Charles River Laboratories and why I think buy and hold is really important. So, uh, yes, uh, buy and hold is really important. Hello everybody and welcome to this brand new video. Today, ugh. hello everybody and welcome to this brand new stocks and option talk. Today you won't actually be seeing me because I'm still kind of ill. Um, I want to focus today on Charles River Laboratories and why I think earnings are basically not saying anything and why you should not really care so much about earnings. And the reason for that is, you see, recently, Charles River had earnings on November 3rd. And they still beat, beat the earnings. But for some kind of reason, the stock plummeted 10%. And from the all-time high, it is now roughly 20% away which is the way it is uh, <coughs> sorry for that but if we take a look at the long term graph we still see an outstanding and performing business nothing changed they beat the earnings almost every time and as you've seen in my video I made about them, they are still the driving business and I'm still happy to be a shareholder of them and I still assume they will make money in the years to come. But this is, this is basically the same as I, made, as I said in my PayPal video. So they had that crazy high run of 300, over 300% loss in the last one and a half years obviously they plummet now a bit but the main thing is here about earnings so as we can see they're still making money nothing changed maybe not make it they're not making as much money as some investors would hope to make maybe their revenue is not as much as some people or some analysts would like it to be but if we go to the investor relation page, we can see that nothing really happened here. So nowhere here is written or they're, they're, that they're losing billions of dollars now and that they have to close the whole fucking company. Uh, what I want to tell you is if something like that happens, Take a look at the company, check whether they're still making money. If they're still making money, it's all right. You, you, you still, still, you still shall be an investor or a stockholder of company X Y Z. In my case, Charles River Laboratories. Because again, over time, I assume they will make money. Give yourself a point where you sell, where you say you will sell the stock, because. Maybe they've fallen too much or you don't believe in the business anymore or through. I would not really recommend that because this is a typical bias of us humans. So if you haven't already subscribed that you won't miss my video about the biases and how psychology is affecting our investments. To sum it up, I think if you found a wonderful business, as Warren Buffett would say, like Charles River Laboratories, just stay invested, regardless of what the earnings say. Don't care about the earnings or these analysts. To be honest, I don't know why they are sh why they have to be earnings every three months. I think it's kind of useless. But that's it. Look for wonderful businesses and then just give it time and over time 
your business will thrive. See you soon, guys. Bye.